Hi everyone, it's Vicky here from Crafty Heron. Thank you very much for joining me today. And today I'm going to be showing you how I created this gorgeous pebble art wood plaque um, decoration. And this is for a lovely couple that were going to their wedding in a few weeks. And it was so simple to make and I hope you enjoy the tutorial. So to make this project you will need a wooden plaque that is from the range in the wedding section and it was $3.99. You'll also need some flower embellishments, leaf trim, some pebbles and sticks from your garden, some scissors, hot glue, stapler, some garden twine to hang your decoration up with and also some wedding stamp sets, some ink and also some acrylic paint and a paintbrush. So to begin with we're going to staple our garden twine to the back of our wooden plaque. So I'm just going to cut some length off and I'm going to use my stapler and staple it on the back. Now the staples didn't go in properly so I did have to bash them in to make them sit flat. But also this wooden plaque is flat at the bottom, I purposely did that so if they didn't want to hang it up then they could stand it up on a sideboard. So next you're going to get your twig and you're just going to bend it slightly to make an archway and you will find that it will break but don't worry we're going to cover that up with our leaf trim. So you're just going to basically hot glue this in position and we will start to embellish it with our leaf trim to cover all the imperfections on our twig. Next you're going to get your leaf trim and I picked this up from Aliexpress and I think it was only a couple of quid for a huge roll. So I think the range also sell these but I think they're only like a metre on a roll so probably better if you pick it up from Aliexpress. So all you're going to do is just going to hot glue that all around your archway and then that will cover up any broken bits on your stick and it just gives a beautiful look to your arch. So I'm just going to decide where to place my pebbles on my wood and I'm just using three or four stones for each person and like I said you could just find these in your garden. So I'm going to position the man on the left and then the woman on the right and as you can see I've used white stones to represent her wedding dress and veil. So I'm positioning these where I want them and then I will hot glue them down later on once I've decorated around them. So I picked up these burlap flowers and these were 
think they were two pounds something and they're for by bare basic and as you can see they are a white creamy color and a brown color so i've just got to hot glue them all the way around my arch and i'm going to add three at the top just to make it a bit more fancy and uh, yeah i think it's looking rather cute so far Now I'm going to stamp my sentiment and I'm going to stamp congratulations and I'm using my Memento Tuxedo Black ink. It doesn't matter what ink you use because you're just using this as a, an outline and we're going to go over it with our acrylic paint so to make it a bit more you know stand out and I'm also stamping this heart and I'm going to colour that in with my paint as well. So while the ink is just drying, I'm going to hot glue my pebbles into place. So now that ink has dried, I'm just going to go in and paint my heart with a red acrylic paint and I'm going to heat set that between each coat to make the drying process quicker. I ended up doing three coats to make it quite stand out and I also go around the outline with my black acrylic paint as well so you can see the outline of the heart. I also go over the congratulations with my acrylic paint and brush. So here is the finished result, I absolutely love it and I can't wait to give it to the special couple on their big day. I hope you all enjoyed this tutorial and give it a go and please give this video a big thumbs up please subscribe to my channel and also guys please hit that notification bell so you can be notified when I upload videos. Take care everyone and I'll see you very soon. Bye!